it's Yita and today I thought I would just kind of film a day in my Christmas holidays. I've got a few things to do today. I want to wrap my Christmas presents. I need to do some more reading. I've also got to go and get my COVID vaccine, my second dose, um, but that's at like 2.15. Currently it's 10.30. I've had breakfast, but that's literally it. I just woke up really late and I just read for a bit. Um, yeah, but you know, it's Christmas holidays. I'm loving just being able to go with the flow and not have to really like restrict my time. Obviously I do have some work to do, but not too much. And I'm just prioritizing resting because last term was hard. <laughs> it was really, really long and tiring, so. Yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna change my sheets, um, tidy my room a little bit and go and have a shower um, first. Just kind of like fully prepare for the day. Hold up, I am on my way. I'm in motion. Let's go to the ocean. Yeah, let's go outside. We can hang out on the beach with our friends. Okay, so I'm gonna wear this top so that I can get my vaccine, but I will be wearing this on top because it is freezing. Um, but yes, I really like this top. It is new. My mum kind of got it for me as an early Christmas, New Year's present. But yes, bit of an outfit of the day. <laughs> um, it's actually now 12. I've just been faffing around um, for a while, but I... I'm now gonna go and eat lunch. Um, I think I'm gonna have like a Caesar salad sandwich, which I'm so looking forward to. <laughs> Then me and my sisters were just reading in the living room, but I thought I'd take this moment just to explain. My family aren't religious, so we don't celebrate Christmas. Christmas for us is a pretty normal day, but everything is closed, so we just take that opportunity to spend time as a family together. But we do all the Christmas traditions just on New Year's. That's when we all gather together, have a family meal, open our presents. Um, so yeah, that's just how we do things. Okay, so... I need to go and get my vaccine very soon. It's currently 1.45 and I've booked it for 2.15 so I need to um, get going soon so I actually have like ample time to sign in. But yeah, I'm, I'm a bit nervous. Oh, I, I don't know why I'm so nervous. I've been putting it off for so long and I just need to do it. Um, for my first one, I was like less stressed, which is really weird. Um, but yeah, I have health anxiety so it's not the needle itself that is kind of scares me i i don't mind needles at all actually um it's more just like the afterwards of the vaccine i'm just like really scared that i don't know that i won't feel well or like there'll be side effects which i know they won't because i had the first one and i'm clearly fine with them um and anyway like even so, I think it's better to get the vaccine than get COVID because like everyone reacts to COVID so differently. And I think that's more dangerous than the vaccine. And like, I trust science and everything, but I'm still nervous, <laughs> but I'm going to do it. I'm going to get it done. Okay. So I'm going to bring my Kindle as well um, to read whilst waiting after the vaccine. Um, I think you have to wait like 15, 20 minutes. Um, just to keep my mind off things and yeah it's not a big deal i'm trying to just like make it not a big deal if you haven't got your second dose yet i encourage you to go and get it for your safety and for everyone else around you yay let's go my dad's coming with me so i'm not alone <laughs> okay i got the vaccine i'm done yay <laughs> um it doesn't hurt like my arm doesn't i say that now it will probably later but she did it really really slowly um i would i have to say i was quite anxious afterwards like in the observing room um where i waited for like 15 minutes i just felt very very anxious and like on my walk home i felt very anxious right now i'm feeling okay um i think i just i'm fine it's all good um and yeah i'm proud of myself vaccine done yeah it's good um i think i'm gonna just sit for a bit um 
maybe watch a YouTube video. Actually, no, I want to read. I started a new book. It's called Mistletoe Motive. It's quite short. It's only like 180 pages. Um, but it's like a Christmas romance story. And it's so cute. And I love it. So it's like set in a bookshop as well. Um, it's great. So yeah, I think I'm going to read some of that. After making some tea for my mum, we just sat in the living room, I was doing some editing, she was calling my grandma, and then we also watched a few episodes of The Witcher, which is very, very good. Um, we also did some Christmas present wrap, well, New Year's present wrapping. So that was everything that I did that day. We spent most of the Christmas holidays just doing things like baking and playing card games, watching movies. We even went to see A Christmas Carol in the theatres. But yeah, I hope you and your family had a lovely Christmas if you do celebrate it. And here's to a more positive New Year. <laughs> Bye.